You get the part, yeah? Uh, is this your car as well, yeah? yeah? Will you move this one and move the car here? Yeah. Yeah, okay? Just just put that one on the ground, yeah? Okay. So that's a flat skate and... Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. So guys, uh, so we started to remove the, the underneath uh, bolts and that. No? So what we have here... See this one here? This is the engine mount. This is the front engine mount and the rear engine mount. So to get this straight, the engine mount on both sides, it has a 14 mil bolt, like this one here. 14 mil bolt. And then uh, the drive shaft guide, it has the torx, torx, torx bolts on both sides. So we only need to remove the two bolts here, two bolts, and then after uh, removing that uh, engine mount on both sides, we have also the crossbar here, like uh, engine support, and then we try, try to undo all this uh, plug here. This is the reverse uh, sensor, and then the. Try to unplug those two, and then, yeah. and then here we have to remove the two nuts and the engine mount. I mean, a bolt joint. Good. But see the problem here. See this thing here. This is a 30 mil uh, socket, no? But it doesn't go in there because this is only like. Uh, not deep enough to penetrate the inside so it needs obviously it needs a deep socket 30 mil uh, deep socket but since we have no deep socket these back rings that we have here will do purposely just to crack open the crack open with the uh, what is this the spanner Back rings. That will be enough to penetrate our uh, socket, thirty mil socket. So we just keep on, keep on doing it, and then it goes out. But sometimes these things. It did uh, stuck as well. So we will see. We need to have the plan B. If this drive shaft sees, then we need to have the plan B. So this is obviously it's very hard. It's smoking because it's too hard. Okay? But, uh,. That's no problem because we took it off already, so that's a good thing. So that's it.
these out. Situation is very difficult. Seems like it doesn't burn out. We'll try. We need to pull out this trap shaft. Otherwise, this will be very, very hard to put it down. Like so, so casa tangal na dino. Grabbing mass on it. So dito nyo siya trahin guys Ang minamasa nyo ito Use this Chisel And hammer it down like that And outside The reason why uh, uh, It's very hard to remove Because of this thing here This is the Like a uh, Retainer clip For the drive shaft Inside locking in the gearbox inside so we're going to the other side as well how to remove so see this here we're going to tap this in in order this thing to expand outside tap once you tap down use the 28 30 mil this one enough space in there so this is how you remove the drive shaft and once you got the leverage in here you're gonna use the guns Okay. This is the problem here. 
That's it. And then now, and then remove the old one from here. Separate it from the hub. So that's how you remove the drive shaft guys on both sides. So just here. The there are the brackets in here on the side of the engine side bracket. Don't remove the bracket on the side of the engine, just remove this one here. Two two torque bolts and then here. And that's how things go down. So you remove the trap shaft on both sides. Thank you.